The Kalachuris of Kalyani were a 12th century Indian dynasty, who ruled over parts of present day northern Karnataka and Maharashtra. This dynasty rose to power in the Deccan region between 1156 and 1181 CE. 25 years. The rulers of the dynasty traced their origins to one Krishna, who is said to have conquered Kalinjar and Dahala in present day Madhya Pradesh. See Kalachuris of Tripuri. Bayala, a viceroy of the dynasty, is said to have established the authority over Karnataka after wresting power from the Chalukya king Tela III. Bayala was succeeded by his sons Someshvara and Sangama but after 1181 CE, the Chalukyas gradually retrieved the territory. Their rule was short and turbulent and yet very important from a socio-religious point of view. A new sect known as the Lingayat or Virashaiva sect was founded during these times in a time extent of 25 years. A unique and purely native form of Kannada literature poetry called the Vachanas was also born during this time. The writers of Vachanas were called Vachanakaras poets. Many other important works like Virapaksha Pandita's Chenabasavapurana, Durrani Pandita's Bichalarayacharite and Chandrasagara Varni's Bichalarayapurana were also written. <inaudible> Origin The Kalachuris of Kalyani overthrew the Kalyani Shalukas in the early part of the 12th century, and had a relatively short but stormy rule. The name, Kalachuri, is shared by multiple earlier dynasties, two of which ruled in central India. Some historians such as Dr. P. B. Desai believe that the southern Kalachuris of Kalyani are descendants of these central Indian dynasties. In the 6th century, before the rise of the Badami Chalukyas, the Kalachuris of Mahishmati had carved out an extensive empire covering areas of Gujarat, Malwa, Konkan and parts of Maharashtra. However, after their crippling defeat at the hands of Chalukya Mangalisha, they remained in obscurity for a prolonged period of time. Subsequently, the Kalachuris of Tripuri and their branches rose to power in central India. A 1174 CE record says the Kalyani Kalachuri dynasty was founded by one Soma who grew beard and mustache to save himself from the wrath of Parashurama, and thereafter the family came to be known as Kalachuris. Kali meaning a long mustache and Churi meaning a sharp knife. They migrated to the south and made Magalaveda or Mangalavdi Mangalavada their capital. They titled themselves Kalanjara Puravaradisvara, Lord of Kalanjara, which indicates their central Indian origin. Their emblem was Suvarna Vrishaba or the Golden Bull. They must have started as modest feudatories of the Shalukas of Kalyani. They were also referred to as Katachuris shape of a sharp knife and Haihaya or Hihaya. The later records of the dynasty claim that they descended from Brahma, the creator of the universe. As feudatories of Shalukas The early Kalachuris of the south were Jains and encouraged Jainism in their kingdom. The first notable chief of the Kalachuri family of Karnataka was Uchita. While there were several kings who followed him ruling as feudatories of the Kalyani Shalukas, it was Jagama who became an influential vassal of Vikramaditya VI, being related to the great Shalukya king by matrimony. <laughs> <laughs> Decline of Kalachuris The southern Kalushori kingdom went into decline after the assassination of Bichaya. The rulers who followed were weak and incompetent, with the exception of Sovadeva, who managed to maintain control over the kingdom. Western Chalukyas ended the Kalachari dynasty. Many Kalachari families migrated to Kanara districts of Karnataka. The Kalachuris are the principal characters in the Andhra epic The Battle of Palnadu. <laughs> rulers Uchida Asaga Kanam Kiryasaga Bayala I Kanama Jagama Pramadi Bayala II proclaimed independence in 1162. Sovadeva Malugi II overthrown by brother Sankama Sankama Ahavamala (1180–1183), Singana (1183–1184). 
Inscriptions and coinage As per the 1163 CE inscription which records a religious offering Mahadana in the presence of Hampi Lord Virapaksha by Bayala the Kalachari king, the southern Kalachari kings minted coins with Kannada inscriptions on them. <laughs> Notes <laughs>